In this video, we will create the new demonic Goro in anime fighters. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and like the video for free bow bugs. Hey yo, what up? F mine is gang gang. Welcome again to Anime Fighter Simulator, guys. We got a brand new waifu. Whoa, it's my from Bunny Girl Senpai. Baba We've Boy. actually replaced the last waifu because, well, the last waifu was kind of ugly. I ain't gonna lie. She was a waifu, but this is way better. It's Easter, so why not have a bunny girl, right? Damn, look at this. Hey, that's all I'm saying, guys. They got some pretty neat waifus in this game. You can create any team that you want. Just letting y'all know that. And speaking of creating any team you want, we're actually gonna be creating the new demonic unit today. We're gonna see how we can do it the easiest way. And I've already farmed, I believe, most of the requirements. So we actually don't even have to do that much work. Remember when the update dropped? We farmed a bunch of those like bunny tokens. I got like 1,100. You can farm this in literally like 30 minutes or something. All you gotta do is kill the enemies around the map. You kill the evil bunny here, turn on auto attack, and then just have at it. Like, I mean, I can show you real quick. You just turn on auto attack, and as long as you had, like, you know, the artifact of attack. I'm lagging, by the way. That's why it's not a one-shot, but it's actually a one-shot. And then you get, like, one token, two token, and then you farm a bunch of bunny tokens. You go to the Easter markets, and then you could just purchase these right here. I don't know what these are. It's like candy, jelly, or something like that. And we have some lollipops over here. Costs like 350 bunny tokens, 350 for the other one, 700 total. You use that, you go to the machine over here in the Easter Island on the right side. You can make the godly being on the right side here. And I believe this is gonna be Cosmic Garo, if you guys have seen One Punch Man. I've seen season one, season two, waiting for season three. Baba Cosmic Garo, he's not even in One Punch Man anime yet, but he's in the manga. So I don't know, you guys let me know if we're gonna try to make this. You only need 35 lollipops, by the way and 50 of these like candy things. Now, some people in the Discord have been saying that you need worst spirit and rain in order to make this guy. Requirements are super easy. You could farm this in 30 minutes. However, the unit requirements, not the item requirements, units, you gotta get infused versions. It might take a little bit of time. However, F minus, you already know your boy, he already has a bunch of infused divines. I just have them. I mean, I've had worse spirit for like the longest time whenever she came out. You guys know I have a full team of infused. And then rain, I'm pretty sure I have one or two more infused rains. Always make copies, guys. And then, I mean, we should be able to make godly being. We can check him out. I don't know. Well, I mean, we might be able to limit break him. I mean, the requirements, like the items here is easy, right? Compared to making other demonics, other evolutions in the game, really easy. True Demon King, you have to farm the portals and gates. Could take you hours, maybe like one or two hours. Sung John, you have to farm like, you know, the evolution shards. You got to get like all this like other stuff. Um, yeah, that could take you a couple hours. This minutes as long as you have the units so once again i'm not sure what the requirements are but i do believe it's worth spirit and rain we can definitely test it so like i said why don't we test it out you only need these right here i guess we're gonna buy the gummies i have enough and then i'm gonna buy the lollipops right there so you got 200 of those 100 of those i guess they're trying to make it so that it's easy for you guys to make a bunch of these the only problem is i don't know what the requirements are do you need infused or do you only need limit broken? Somebody in the Discord was like, you only need limit broken. I'm like, uh, <laughs> is that a thing? I don't know. We can test it out though. Worst spirit. And then I think from what I read in the Discord, don't know if it's right. They said rain. I have one more. So we can try to evolve it. If it doesn't work, I'll try to switch the places. If it doesn't work, I got to go back to the Discord server. Fighter one's not valid. Okay, cool. So maybe rain on top. Worst spirit on the bottom. Both of them are infused. Fighter 1 is not valid still for this recipe. So I gotta double check it. Is my rain infused? Yes, he is infused. Yes, he's shiny. So maybe it's not rain. Um, it's not worth spirit either. I gotta double check it real quick. Yo, so we got the good news and we got the bad news. That's why I do these videos, guys. We're here to discover exactly what it takes to make these units and to check out the entire update. I looked through the entire Discord server, I think. And I say I think because I'm praying this works. I know what the requirements are. You need the newest divine 
which is not worse spirits. Remember when I said newest divine? I mean, technically she is the quote newest divine, but the actual newest divine is gonna be this bunny. People were calling it carrot. I don't know who that is. I don't know if that's like the anime name, but they were saying carrot, right? So that is the newest divine. I thought they were talking about worse spirit and it just so happens the good news I already have one that's limit broken. I literally had this since the update came out. Easy stuff. I just clone her two more times and then infuse her. That's like one or two hours tops. And I believe she would go in the first slot. And the second slot, people were saying that it's rain. I don't know if it's actually rain, but that's why I'm doing the video. We already have the lollipops. We got the candy. All I got to do now is go to Mystic Island and double check we can infuse her like i said i'm willing to do this and sacrifice my time uh just to show you guys because hey why not that's why we do the videos and i already have one created so it's good so let's put her in here it's gonna take 132 hours but if you do the math if you have 60x time multiplier 70x time multiplier it only counts i think half of it this would take about two hours, I would say, or I guess like three or four hours. But you guys know I always pay Robux to cut the time in half. Maybe it only takes two hours. If I clone it two times, four hours. In four hours, I will have an infused Bunny Girl Senpai. I think that's pretty good. So once I get this infused unit, let's head back to Easter Island and double check this evolution. And hopefully we got the requirements right. So after about maybe a year, nah, it's probably been half a day. <laughs> that took a long time. We now have an infused Bunzy Easter 2024. Keep in mind, this is the craftable. I just put the illusion on top of Bunzy because Bunzy is kind of ugly. Mai is kind of hot. There you guys go. Now we have the newest divine in the game. This is technically the newest event divine, and this is going to be the newest regular divine. That's why I said earlier, worst spirit. It's actually not worst spirit. It's going to be Bunzy. However, we still don't even know that until I put it on screen for you. This is all just rumors on the Discord. So we got to test it out for ourselves. Let's go ahead and head over to that evolution machine. Oh, you know, I cannot wait. We got the infused bunny right there. I think this is going to be worth it for Garo, especially since Garo is like the coolest, one of the coolest uh, units ever and one of the coolest characters in anime. Um, he's godly being. We have enough lollipops. So once again, we got the gummies. And hopefully if this works, we press evolve and we wait another maybe I, I might be like 45 minutes and it should be done hopefully i'm gonna press evolve in three two and one please work please work yes it worked perfect there you guys go i'm not the only one who's made this by the way i'm sure there's a bunch of other youtubers and a bunch of you guys who have already made it but you do need an infused my or infused bunsy sorry and then you also need rain on the bottom so rain I mean, it could be difficult. Infusing a divine unit in, in general takes a long time. Um, however, Bunzi's not that bad to get. And Bunzi, once you get the divine, you just clone it. Once you clone it, you just stay in the time chamber. You're good to go. There's a 5x time event. Now, all we gotta do is wait 2 days, 23 hours, and uh, 49 minutes. Alright, so we waited and I accidentally claimed it without recording it, which kind of sucks, but let's just pretend. Whoa, I just claimed it right there. <laughs> the name of it is called Godly Being. We can check it out. Currently, he's level 1. 3,100 damage. I don't know if he has an aura, but we can definitely take a look at it. And then, you know, I gotta turn up the graphics for you guys. I really gotta show you how cool he looks. I haven't even seen him yet, by the way. But yeah, that is Cosmic Garo from One Punch Man. So he doesn't have any aura. He's not shiny. I honestly don't even have any demonic fruit to make him look like really cool. I don't even know how his shiny form looks. I could try to farm some demonic fruit for the video, but it might be a little tough. But yeah, that's Cosmic Garo. Um, you know what? A good question is, can I level him up? He's part of the Easter event, so I'm guessing you can't. But his base damage? What is his base damage, actually? It's 3,000. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? No, really, what the hell? 3,500. True Demon King is 23k. What? Aizen is... What is Aizen? 
Uh, Demon Prince is 6.7k. Aizen is probably like, what, 5k? 4k? This is 3 point- Dude, this is the weakest. The weakest demonic unit. Oh my god. However, I've heard rumors, not confirmed, just rumors, that they could buff this guy once the Easter event leaves. However, I don't even know if that's true because you look at the Halloween event, they didn't even buff uh, Sakura here. Uh, 2,200. Toad Sage isn't even buffed yet either, 2,300. However, this is different. This is a demonic unit, so they definitely could buff it. Uh, for right now, though, 3,500. And then Shiny is 6.1k, so that's that's pretty bad. <laughs> that's That's pretty damn bad. I mean, take a look at this. You have the demonic unit 3.5k, or you could just pull the new Bunzy 2.3k. Guess which one is easier to make? Bunzy by a million times. At the bare minimum, I mean, we can go to the Easter passive machine, put the godly being in here. I could token reroll him until we get like a mythic passive. Okay, we pulled a mythic passive. Now we could take a look at him. Does he look a little bit nicer? Um, I don't really see any effects. I don't even have a Ultra performance on. Do I have my graphics? Yep, my graphics are up. What the? I guess he doesn't really have even an aura. Maybe I can change it to something else. Let's see what we got, y'all. Got Easter Bunny. Okay, so what about Easter Bunny? Do we got a cool looking aura with this? Hmm, I don't see anything, guys. What is going on? I thought this would be a really cool unit, but I'm not seeing anything. Blossom Bunny has a really cool aura. So hopefully this one works. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. That looks cosmic. You already know. I gotta change his name, by the way. His name is supposed to be Garou from One Punch Man. There it is, Cosmic Garou, dang! Now he's popping off. Now the big question, can I level him up? Now he might suck bad. When I say suck bad, this dude sucks so hard. 3,000 damage is actually crazy. That's okay though, we go to the incubator, we max level him, maybe he's a little bit better. If we're allowed to, I would say no, but we could be wrong. Yeah, you cannot incubate him because the Easter event is still going on. And you might be like, why F minus? If you could max level him, you could bring him back to Easter Island and then you can equip him and then you would really one shot all the enemies here. They don't want that to happen. So it makes sense. If you want to level him up, you got to do it the old fashioned way, <laughs> which is kind of ghetto. And I guess I can do it, you know, for the video. I can show you guys how to level up units. I already did this before. You just max open once, right? All those units you get, you feed it to the one you have equipped. So we're gonna go from level one to 205. And if you wanna make it a little bit faster, you could use like a super EXP potion. Actually, I i don't know if I have enough tokens, but in the Easter market, there is an XP potion. Ah, I don't have enough, that's okay. I'm just gonna use a super EXP boost then. We got an EXP boost there, super EXP boost. And then I think Chief made Avatar. She gives EXP, 3X EXP. And I'm gonna max open again. Feed it to Garo, and maybe it's a little bit better. I, like I said, if I can make him shiny for the video, I'll definitely try to do it. Currently, he's level 209. Let's try to get him to like 210. We get him to 210. I mean, it's not like level 670, like my other unit, but that's okay. We don't need him 670. All we gotta do is just get him to 211, 130 trillion. And I mean, this is my new strongest unit that I can use on Easter Island. He looks amazing, especially if I. You know, go ahead and turn all those graphics again for you guys. Like I said, I got a bad computer. <laughs> this is just how it is. I unequip him, and then let's go see Garo. I re-equip him. Dang, there he is. Oh Lord, he looks so amazing. Now the last thing we gotta do is, you know, figure out is this worth for you guys to craft? I would say if you want to get like a limited time unit, definitely go for it because he's never going to come back to the game. Look at the patch log. It says right there on my mouse cursor, limited time divine, limited time evolved fighter. If you can, even though the stats suck, just try to make at least one. If you can make one, I mean, you'll be prepared for like future updates whenever, if, if they add trading to the game. I don't know if they will, but if they do, you would be prepared. So it'd be kind of cool. Um, and it's a limited time unit. I mean, just think about it like this. You remember the Divine Pateru Holiday Baby? Not many people have Holiday Baby, guys. So, you know, maybe like if you're still playing Anime Fighters a couple months from now, six months from now, you might be the only unit with a Garou 
and you can't clone him so he's gonna be one of the cooler looking units so that'd be kind of nice and also do the same thing with Bunzi. try to get one copy otherwise damage uh not that good i think it's the lowest base damage out of all of them 3.5k what was Aizen? I, I don't know. I mean, Demon Prince is 6.7. Uh, Coco Melon over here. That's his name in the game. 11k. And then he has 17,000 for Sung John. True Demon King, 23k. That's like a six times damage difference between Garo and Anos. So, I mean, hopefully they buff him in the future. But as of right now, I don't even know if I could recommend it, you know, getting this dude as like a damaging type unit. You're probably better off just sticking with your infused shiny divine worst spirit just definitely make one copy throw a really cool looking passive and then you can be like oh yeah that's a flex because i mean <laughs> it does kind of look like a flex other than that though that is the brand new um demonic units we could try to make it shiny i don't know how many demonic fruits we have by the way uh from what i've heard demonic fruits they're not supposed to be tradable so I mean, take with that what you will. Maybe they'll try to make it, you know, tradable in the future. But if you want to farm demonic fruits, you have to do it yourself. You got to farm it the old fashioned way. You can't trade for them. Apparently, that's how it's supposed to be. It's not a bug. That's just how it is. Let's head to Chimera Jungle, though. All right. So here we are in the Chimera Jungle. I do have a couple of demonic fruit from the previous update. Um, if you remember, like I said, I have like two BO DPS. Uh, full team of spirits 660 on the last update not this update last update and then we had like what double twilight or whatever man i was killing insane dungeon really fast now this this doesn't mean it's going to work so if it doesn't work i'm telling you right now don't blame f minus all right <laughs> i'm only doing this for the video i'm gonna put our Garo in here looks like we got 20 fruits uh that is a 64 percent chance so I'm not saying it's gonna work, but the odds are in our favor. It's just, you know, I don't know. Maybe it does work, maybe it doesn't. I'm gonna sacrifice a couple things though. So I guess the first thing, uh, let's go pick a unit in our inventory. This is just a regular divine. Let's use a uh, 20 fruit. Um, actually, what's the opposite of 20? Two fruit. So we're gonna go ahead and use two fruit, and then if it fails, we should be able to throw Garo in there and then make them shiny, hopefully. <laughs> Crafting filled, perfect, okay, cool. So that's exactly what we wanted. We wanted to sacrifice a divine. That doesn't do anything, that's just the way I do it, and then most of the time it works perfectly fine. So we're gonna take our Garo, we'll put all 20 fruit because that's all I got. I'm not trying to farm anymore, not for this update at least. Insane Dungeon is really difficult. And then I guess, um... If your crafting fails, your old unit will be destroyed along with the fruits. Woo! Do you want to take this chance? Hey, you know, you know what to say, guys. Go big or go home. We got to do it for the video. Plus, we want to have a Garo shiny. I want to see how he looks. That way, maybe you don't use him for damage. Maybe you keep him as a collection. Or maybe use him as a, an illusion. Illusion would be amazing as well. Let's go ahead and do it. Hoping it works. It better work. If it doesn't work, I'm going to be really pissed. Come on, big money right here. You already know how we do it now. Oh, yeah. Dang. That's how we do it. That's how that money does it. Yes, sir. Okay. Cool. So, we got Garo right there. Uh, Godly Being. We can go ahead and equip him. I don't know. Ooh. I feel like he looks, he looks a little different. I mean, he got like a face now. Plus, he has like some kind of thing coming out of him. There's like white stuff coming out of him. Like, legitimately, there's white. You see those little balls of white? Plus his aura. This is actually probably one of the coolest looking passives in the entire game. Blossom Bunny. I don't know what it does exactly, but... Um, yeah, you should get Blossom Bunny. Throw it on Garo or throw it on whatever units you guys have from this update. Easter update. Tell me what your favorite unit is in the comments. Put it on Bulma. Put it on Mai. Put it on... I don't know, Remy. Put it on Worst Spirit. Blossom Bunny is one of the coolest. But yeah, there you guys go. Garo demonic evolution really cool really menacing you would think this guy's the strongest damn unit in the game nope <laughs> not even close 3.5k damage strongest divine 10k base damage strongest evolution 23k damage and whenever i get my heavenly um 48,000 damage so there you guys go let me know what you think really do appreciate though your guys support and until next time guys i'll see you in the next video